Happy Monday. It is Monday, May 5th, 10.23. Um, I'm just getting home. Um, I have switched over. I'm no longer recording on my GoPro 8. Well, at least I'm doing an experiment that um, what gives me a better quality, what gives me a better version of camera. Right now, I'm recording on my Sony A6000. Um, and honestly, I was watching Aaliyah's face, um, and I just like the quality of her videos. And I don't necessarily think that I took that in consideration in recording. Um, and I definitely know it's something that I've taken for granted. Um, but as I'm trying to do better and record consistently and put out um, better content, um, I'm realizing the quality of the video truly does make a difference. Now, I also don't have like a ring light or background lighting and things of that nature. And if I could travel with that and um, make it be successful, then I'll do that. This camera is heavy. Oh my gosh, it's very heavy. So, yeah. So, at the current moment, um, I have changed out of my uniform. I am about to pay my rent. Um, and a few other bills that I have to pay. I'm going to work out. And then I think I'm going to call it an evening. I've been working since 8 a.m. Yeah, I've been working since 8 a.m. I got home around 10.01. Um... It's been a long day. It's been a long day. You know when you're tired and you just need to go to sleep or you need to get your mind off of something? Well, that is what I am. <clears throat> I just destroyed, ripped my bags through, ran my brain crazy trying to find my wallet, put on my uniform because Patting it down and going in every single pocket wasn't good enough to find my wallet, which is sitting underneath my television and has been this entire time. I was about to get a lift and go back to work and search for my wallet, but it's here. Oh, Now, let's pay some bills. Okay, so happy Happy Tuesday. It's May 2nd. Um, I'm on my way out. Let me tell you, I didn't record all day because I was in bed all day. Um, my ankle has swelled. Um, and I just, I have to figure out how to be productive when I'm home. Like, I think because I work so much, I'm just gone when I come home. I'm really exhausted. I don't want really to move. But being exhausted and not wanting to move leads me to being in bed all day. So I'm up. Um, one of my friends invited me to go to um, his house for tacos. So I'm about to head there. Yeah. Which I'm uberly excited for. Um, I'm going to run to, uh, we have a, a liquor store not too far from my apartment, so I'm going to run to the liquor store first, grab some um, margarita mix and um, tequila, vodka. Um, can you put anejo in margarita? Maybe I'll get an anejo. Yeah, but um, shortly I will be running late, so I'm going to wrap this up, get on the road, order my car. And uh, go have tacos. Happy Tuesday.
So, because I was just reading, I'm watching um, the Maslin. I think that's their YouTube name. But nonetheless, um, I'm also getting ready for work. Um, I don't know if I'm going to like recording on this camera. It's heavy. I did find a tripod stand um, to act as maybe a stabilizer or a grip, which I would definitely say has maybe distributed the weight in some sort of capacity that doesn't make it as heavy, but it's still very heavy. Um, two, when I do the playback of the video, it's dark. It is very dark, so I'm not a big fan of that. Um, yeah. But, happy uh, Wednesday. Okay, Google, what's today's day? Think? It's Wednesday, May 3rd, 2023. Happy Wednesday, May 3rd. Now, so Google can improve. Let me make sure I heard you correctly. I think you said, what's today's day? Was that right? Yes. Thanks for helping to improve a system for everyone. Um... I'm currently packing my suitcase. Um, I'm on my way to Orlando. Today's actually a pretty long day. Um, I don't think that I get to Orlando until like midnight. So, um, yeah, about that. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm in Orlando from midnight till I think like 7.30 tomorrow. Um, there's really no reason for me to pack a suitcase. I'm not gonna be able to go anywhere. It's going to be dark. Um, I'm not trying to spend any money, so I'm going to the free breakfast. I probably will walk to Wawa, though, and get lunch. I could bring a lunch. I've had a hoagie in my refrigerator. It's one of them, like, store-bought hoagies that are already pre-made, but I want to say that's been in there for, like, a week now. If not, it's definitely been a week and it may have been going on to like a week and a half, a week and three days. I probably should throw it away. Um, but yeah, I'm packing my bag. I'm going to get out of here um, at uh, basically 10 o'clock. I don't have to be to work until 11. So that's the goal for today. Um, I have to start recording when I'm not doing anything. Or even though I don't think it's like blog worthy because I'm noticing that I just say hey to y'all and goodbye to y'all and that's that and that has to leave for a boring vlog especially when I'm not out and about doing things so I'm gonna be better at that um, but in the meanwhile I'm packing my bag so watch your brother pack his bag Good morning. It's May 4th, so may the 4th be with you if you're into Star Wars. Um, I'm in Florida this morning. Yay. I don't leave here until like 7 or 8 o'clock. Um, I just got done from posting um, a short little video because, um, I mean, y'all should know, but I had my, uh, I had two packages stolen and... Um, I just don't feel like my apartment complex is doing enough. Um, they have their own cameras, um, but it's not to my knowledge that they reviewed their own cameras to like watch the thieves or anything. So, um, I'm pretty sure nothing is going to come of these videos, but I did want to share it and, um, I'm brainstorming ideas on... How to be my own personal vigilante. <laughs> but yeah, if you don't follow me on Instagram, my Instagram is SLLJXD. I'll put the link in my bio, but um, essentially, this was a little video. You can go on my Instagram and watch it. Uh, I'll put the link in the description, excuse me. I'll put the link to the, the video in the description, and then you can just follow me from Instagram. But... <clears throat> It's 10.30. I need to uh, get up, go to the gym. Um, I was going to go to Disney Springs because it's free to walk around. 
Um, but I'm not. Um, I'm going to stay in um, and work on a few things. I'm going to... Yeah, I want to stay in and work on a few things. Um, I really, I really need to plan um, a number of things. Also, I'm supposed to be celebrating this weekend. I'm supposed to be going out. Um, tomorrow is May 5th, which is Cinco de Mayo. So that'll be a little fun weekend. Um, so yeah, I need to make sure that I'm prepared and ready for that. I need to clean my apartment. I feel like I'm always cleaning my apartment. I feel like I'm always saying I'm cleaning my apartment, but when I get home, like I'm out and about and I don't get it actually done. Or like I'll get a room done, but not the entire thing. So I've also been contemplating on getting um, one of those cleaning services. I had a friend who got a cleaning service. I should reach out to him and ask how he liked it. Yeah. But I'm up. I'm up and at him, and today we'll be moving. Maybe nothing interesting, but we'll be moving. One thing I absolutely hate is going to the gym, and it's a small gym, and people still try and cram their way in the workout. Go to your room, do push ups, do squats, do something else. Don't come into the gym when it's just me in there and two other pieces of equipment that you can't even use because I'm using them. But I forgot my gloves. So I'm about to go back downstairs. <sighs> I definitely don't feel like going in there with them because like, dang. But. If you have it. Look at the sunroof, too. All right. Uh, it's okay. So um, right now, whoa, Amy? It's well into the afternoon. Happy Cinco de Mayo. It's Friday, May 5th, well into the afternoon. Um, I spent majority of my morning, my entire morning, and a portion of my afternoon editing this vlog that's about to go up. Um, as you know, it is 2.22. Um... And yeah, I'm about to get up, uh, what's this vlog? Where are we at? I don't know why it's going so slow. I also have to clear um, a lot of space on my computer and um, delete it because, excuse me, because um, there was a couple times where it prompted me that I didn't have enough space on my disk. Um, so I need to figure out how to do all that. It's kind of crazy because I've had this computer maybe for three or four years and I never used it. <laughs> and now that I am starting to use it, um, there are a lot of mistakes that I'm making. Um, like how I deleted two blogs and I didn't realize that. Um, or even like finding out that there's just not enough space in here. Generally, I just utilize a website, I get off of it and keep it pushing. But yeah, so that's that. But um, I'm gonna get a haircut today. I'm going to, um, like always, in every blog and every single time I get on, uh, clean something in here. And um, I'm going out for tacos and drinks later. And I have a party to go to this evening. Um, I do need to also pack my bag because Saturday, Sunday, I'll be in um, L.A. And Monday evening, I have to work. So Monday evening, I'll be flying back to Houston. That's the goal for the weekend. Yeah. So I will um, put you down um, and get ready. The goal is to definitely have this vlog up by... 3 p.m. and I still need to find the video for my trailer so yeah I'm gonna put you down get ready um, reach out to my barber and start making moves so I can continue being productive
so I know I told y'all that I was going to the barber shop to get a haircut, which I did. Um, but in the meanwhile, I've been invited out to um, get tacos and drinks. So yeah, I'm going to get ready. I'm actually just wearing what I have when I went to the barber shop: black tee, black shorts. I probably should put on something lighter, but it's hot out. And um, it's probably wiser that I put on something lighter. The only thing is I don't have an iron. Majority of my clothes have wrinkles, so it's kind of um, it's kind of easier just to wear this because I wore it. Some of the wrinkles have already fallen out. But let me hurry up and get ready. And um, I will definitely record. This camera is so heavy. I took this camera to the barber shop to do a time lapse of my haircut, which I will insert. Easy, peasy, light, fit in my pocket it was no big thing. This camera, jeez, just just speaking to you, my arm is tired. So I don't. I definitely won't be recording with this next week. <laughs> um, if I have to buy a new one of these just to update the quality. I'll do that. If I have to buy multiple batteries, I'll do that. But this is heavy. This is heavy for no reason. I'm home. I got my Amazon packages. Um, you know the Amazon little locker thing? That wasn't... That's not far at all. Um, and I have 24 access to the post office, which I was trying to understand, you know, how does that happen? Does one of my keys open it? But they leave the door open and you have key, you have access to your P.O. box. That was cool. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling this P.O. box thing just a little more. But, um, so I'm back. It's currently 8.16. Um, so I'm going to try my best to get dressed, get out of here. And, uh, whoa, 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 go back. I need to pack my suitcase. I'm going to Los Angeles in the morning. My flight's at like five something. So I need to be um, back at my apartment, getting my suitcase and heading to the airport. I'm going to say by four just to be on the safe side. <sighs> yeah, that's the goal. So um, I'm going to pack my suitcase for Los Angeles. I'm going to shower, get ready to head out tonight. And have me a good old time. Yeah. Happy Sunday. So, Friday night I went out. Um, when I went out, I lost my keys. And the venue place that I went to, they... Everyone saw my keys. The following morning I went back. Everyone told me they saw my keys. They explained my keys to me. However, they were nowhere to be found. So I was annoyed about that because I was locked out of my apartment. And basically I was locked out of my apartment from 1 a.m. to 10.30. And it was just, it was a long day. So then I went to the airport to try and catch a flight. And um, all three of the flights I tried to catch were oversold. So I couldn't make it to LA. Um, so I literally spent the day a bit. I needed it. <laughs> I was exhausted from staying up, from going out, from drinking, to sitting in the airport trying to catch a flight. So it is Sunday night. Sunday night at 9.19. Um, I kind of want to write someone um, and see if they're free and go out. Um, because it's the last day of Pride. Um, but I also need to um, clean my apartment. Not necessarily clean it, but um, when I get ready to go out, um, I try on multiple things and I don't put them away right away. So they're just all over my house. Well, all over my bedroom, I should say. And I have bought a few things from Amazon. So, like, the wrappers and stuff are in a corner and the outfits that I wore are just on the floor. Or the outfits that I didn't wear are on the floor. So, 
Um, it's probably best that I stay here and I'm productive and clean. I don't really have the energy to go out anyway. I think I just want to. And that's that. But, um, yeah. I'm going to get up. Um, I kind of actually want to watch a YouTube video and then get up. But I'm going to get up and clean my apartment. Let me show you this cologne that I bought. So, um, I bought this cologne off of Amazon. Now, um, it does smell like peaches. One of my concerns... So, the comments warned, warned you that it comes on sweet. But wait for the dry down. Um, and I wore this around one person since I've worn it and I asked them how they smelt it or how it smelled on me and they said it smelled fresh. Um, I could smell it faintly. Um, I generally like fragrances that, um, are overpowering or have a lot of sillage. They have a lot of projection to them, but I don't think this one did. However, um, I did smell it consistently on me. It's not like one of those colognes where you spray it, you smell it for like an hour, maybe two hours, and it disappears. Um, I did consistently smell this. Um, but I would definitely say once it dries down, it's a lot more matte. It's not as strong as a peach scent. I just still don't know if I like it. Um, so I'm excited to go to work on Monday night because I'm going to wear it then to see if I get any compliments or anyone comments on it um and i guess i'm still trying to confirm if it's my ideal of a male fragrance if you've owned this or smelt it please let me know um what your thoughts are um and if you have any recommendations for summer fragrances um let me know those too i'm going to start buying more fragrances probably more so like the dupes or the cheaper ones off of amazon because I do buy um, more expensive fragrances. Um, I'm starting to realize that I do enjoy a lot of Tom Ford fragrances, which run up to 150. I think the most expensive fragrance I've ever bought was like $400. But it was a big bottle. It does last very long. I do get compliments on it. Um, but I do want to start smelling. I do want to start, you know, wearing more fragrances. But I don't get out enough to feel like I justify it. And the time that I'm that I am out is not really with people that I want to smell me, if that makes sense. But let me get up 